I'm sick again. <laughs> this is the second time I've been sick in like a month. We're gonna work past it and today we're gonna do a Sunday reset. Since I'm sick, I feel like it's a good day just to clean everything and go through everything. I've been wanting to do this for a while, but I've been so busy and so we're gonna do it today. But first I need to eat something because it's almost 11 and I haven't had any food today. Also, I took a shower and um, put a little tiny makeup on with the hopes that it would make me feel a little bit better today. It's kind of working. If you are new here, I'm Amanda, a single 44-year-old artist living in Seattle with my dog Baker and my cat Louie. I'm currently recovering from cancer and actually I'm still in maintenance treatment and just figuring out what is next for me. Some could say I'm in a little bit of a midlife, not so crisis, but something. And instead of reaching for that external dopamine hit, I'm just trying to go inward and figure out what is next. I feel really discombobulated right now. My hope resetting today is to just do a really good clean. I want to go through the cabinets, my clothes, clean everything really well, and hopefully we'll see how long I can go for today. I might have to do this in phases because I don't feel good, but I just don't feel like laying around even though I should rest. I'm gonna make some breakfast first. I'm gonna get to work. So I think today is gonna be the day two where I fix the tiles, the peel and stick tiles in my kitchen. I have been like putting this off because it just doesn't seem like a very fun project, but they're so gross and they're driving me nuts. But that's gonna be a post cleaning project if I have enough energy at the end of this and then if not then I'll do it tomorrow or Tuesday. taste whatsoever I'm basically just eating for sus sustenance <laughs> I'm just eating for energy right now I'm wondering if maybe I have COVID apparently everybody's getting it right now and I was just on an airplane so I don't know if this is actually gonna happen because I haven't done anything other than eat and pick up a few things and I feel like I need a nap. I know I'm gonna get a bunch of comments from people saying you should just rest, but I feel like for the last six weeks, all I've done is rest. And I really need to clean my place out. So we're gonna just go slow today and take our time. What we get through, we get through. As I'm putting dishes away, I am going to clean things out so I'm not backtracking. I don't need that anymore. I don't need this. I don't need this. All right, 
great. So this is one area that I have not cleaned out in so long. Oh. One thing that I could look into is getting more organizers for under here. Um, I don't know. That is what I'm feeling very pulled to is just getting everything so organized, getting rid of anything I do not use. I have a tendency to hold on to things. This is my old dog's handkerchief, scarf, but definitely not getting rid of this. Baker's Christmas scarf <laughs> and then Louise but he won't wear it so we'll try again this year though I'm starting to hit a wall, but I'm gonna keep going a little bit longer. And then I need to take Baker on a walk. Wait, this one's not going here. So I started my Sunday reset video last week and then I got really sick again. I still don't feel good, but I am just continuing on from where I left off. I did manage to clean my kitchen out a bit. And so today I have to run over to a client's house and fit um, something I'm, I'm building them a banquette seating and then i'm going to come home and continue working through this whole sunday reset that i'm trying to do every single week i'll be back
I ended up not doing anything this past weekend. So I have this like really cute little <laughs> rogue hair. But yeah, I I am going to the doctor today because I'm pretty sure I have walking pneumonia. And I just, I feel like I have a slight fever. Or I have had a slight fever for a good week now. And whatever cold I had is moved. It's like this heaviness in my chest. Hi, baby. Heaviness in my chest. So this weekend, I literally just laid on the couch and watched TV and needle pointed, as you saw. And I'm making this really cute little Christmas village and that I'll put on my wall during the holidays. And I'm actually, I'm just really loving Needlepoint. I have several ideas of other things I want to do with Needlepoint. I didn't get done anything that I wanted to do. I did go through Notion a little bit this past weekend. And then I am going to start doing um, monthly plan with me. So at the end of the month, so next week's video will kind of be a, a sit down going through what I want the following. And this is an attempt for me to just to get a lot more organized and to set myself up better with goals and hopefully feel more successful in my my days or my months, um, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna show you my Notion. It's what I use to kind of organize my life. I also have a paper calendar that I use as well. Um, or attempt to use but all of this is just to to really help me get clarity into what it is I even want for myself and the bigger picture trying to talk more about is just like this post cancer survivorship world where you feel like just post survivorship just you feel like you look like the same person but you feel like such a different person I'm in this really interesting place where I am like midlife and just navigating what I want my world to look like. Join me next week as I do my very first plan with me for the month of November where I take you through Notion and how I'm going to be using it to get very organized in my life. And don't forget to hit the follow, thumbs up, and like this video so it gets out to more people. See you next time.